the wild. Oh, 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 game. Wow. Huge right hand. Oh, they had a padding away on the side of Jamel oh, Jones' goodness. head. And now in full mount. This is a rough spot for Stuart Austin. You better figure out how to get out of here. And there it the is. The referee right waves it off. Bruno Cavaloza, six points in a first round finish. The returning champion once again. Just such an exciting style, so dynamic. Whether he's on his feet or on the ground, he's looking to finish, and he has so much power in his hands. As, as fast and explosive as he is, he's methodical at the same yes, time. Absolutely. And that is a wicked combination. Yeah, he's, he's certainly not wild with anything. Yeah, exactly. He can use grappling to get himself into ground and pound scenarios. Uh, even when he's un, in that top position, he's not flailing around with his offense. Bruno Capaloza is dangerous. Faisal Lenova needs to be really careful. She's ducking that head down. Needs to be careful. The knee around. Another right oh, hand. Big Another. shot. The Sounds referee in the trouble. waves it off. Larisa Pacheco with a big TKO and six points in the lightweight standings. The odds, the onslaught started early, Randy, oh. and it continued often. Combinations were sharp. She sat on every punch. She made every single one of them count. The referee, the referee steps in. He had seen enough. Cody Goodell not improving position. And the referee waves it off. Dennis Goldsov, a quick six points for that first round finish. Yeah, he was methodical. He was relentless. Cody Goodale just did not have an answer really anywhere. Wasn't able to isolate that jab. And on the ground, he took some really heavy shots. Corey Hendricks goes to work with the left hand here in the people's oh, main event. Full mount. And wailing away, Corey Hendricks punching. Referee standing over the action here. And that will do. Second round finish and a big time upset for Corey Hendricks, who came into this bout as a massive dog. What a performance from Corey Hendricks. Smart approach, chopped down that lead leg from Sorty. We saw his potential when he submitted Hamlet last season, so he was no slouch heading into this. He knew the challenge that was in front of him, and he came up big against the former champ. Oh, Soto comes in and eats a tough shot for his troubles, and there's a knee on the retreat, and another to the body. Rusi Soto in big trouble. Wilkinson pounding away with the right hand. Referee seen enough. Five points for Wilkinson. A successful PFL debut. He had a quiet confidence about him all week, and that's exactly why he looked phenomenal. I'm not sure he made a mistake tonight. Great job picking his combinations, being patient. <clears throat> Soto coming in with the, the wider punching, and, and Wilkinson able to come right down the middle and make him count. Impressive debut for Robert Wilkinson. He was a light heavyweight champion in the Brazilian promotion. I don't know how he ever made 205. He's got the frame of a heavyweight. Yeah, no question about it. Oh, right hand! And Ante Dillion knocks down Sheffield again. Gary Copeland says that's enough. A five-point finish in the second round for Ante Dillia. It was a nasty right hand right down the middle that started it. Just nonstop pressure from Ante D'Elia. Tremendous. Incredible power on display in the first round. Wasn't able to get Sheffield out of there, but the second round, he doesn't wait long. Thirty seconds remaining in, inside the oh, showcase. Wow! Was, I believe it was a knee. Oh, Might have been a short knee. Right up the middle, and Simeon Powell, as he's walking oh. away, face plants Clinton Williams. My it was goodness. so quick, I didn't see it. 
<laughs> he wow. just turned him and, and just lifted his knee and just flatlined Clinton Williams. Just precision. Pretty aggressive as well, you know. He's doing a great job here against Manfield and all the wild. Oh, 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 wow. Huge right hand! Hill. Big right hand! And that'll do it! Wow. A comeback for Alex wow. Manfield! Oh. Turns the tide! Unbelievable! Third round finish! Just as I was saying, he does all the right things. He stayed right in the middle and right in front of Manfio. Manfio cut off the K through a beautiful bomb right down the middle. Landed it flush on the jaw of Don Mad. What a right hand. And I tell you, that, that is why Hausch oh. Manfio was a fighter of the year in 2021, because you never count him out. You can go into a third round, maybe two rounds down on the scorecard. Oh. The first two minutes can go by, and then he'll do that. The speed distance <laughs> difference is drastic. Yeah. Oh, big overhand right, and that's not and good, another. Pesta. And another Ahmedov pouring it on early. Pesta dives down to the right oh, hand. Oh, oh, the huge shot. Omari Ahmedov shuts it down. Victor Pesta flat on his back. Those were massive shots, my goodness. Another example, it's not always about size. Speed kills. Akhmedov with some very dangerous shots. Well, Akhmedov was using his speed to get in and get out. Peshta had his chin up in the air a little bit too tall, his hands were low, and Akhmedov was coming up and over those shots and up and over the guard and punches of Peshta. Oh, oh, is that a knee? They had a pounding away on the side of Jamal oh Jones' goodness. head. Wow. And he's out. It all started with that knee, Sean. That rocked him. And those follow-up shots on the ground were absolutely brutal. Time, wow. Time that level change perfectly. It looked like Jamel was looking to level change and shoot. He brought that knee up from six foot eight, landed right on the button. It's a game changer right there for sure. But how's this? In his last outing, hit off a header, a 31 second knockout victory to set a PFL heavyweight record. This one took 25 seconds, which is the new PFL heavyweight knockout record. Hit off a header, first round finish. And that means our man Ian Parker just hit on the prop.